Hey everyone, Jim and I Shadowcat here, and I am back with more DC Universe Online. And for this one, I am doing Five Deadly Sins. Well, there's technically seven. Oracle tell you about Trigon's sin demons? Brother Blood raised them, and now they're all over Metropolis, corrupting people and feeding Trigon's energy. We don't put a stop to this, Trigon will rise, and nobody wants that, trust me. Oh, hell You no. will need all your courage for this fight. Cyborg and the other Titans have already faced Trigon once. Now Trigon's power rises with each citizen corrupted by his sin demons. We must save these people and weaken Trigon's power. Okay then, let's do that. So I said that I was going to pose a question to you guys, and I'm not going to go against my word. This is the question. What is your deadly sin? Um, I would like to know. That would be, be awesome. But yeah, um, my deadly sin is envy, definitely. But I kind of have a little pride in there as well. So yeah, uh, let me know what you what your deadly sin is. So we have been brought into the part where the greed demons have set up camp. We could really use your help. Those Hope demons tore into this armored car. They didn't just take it; they ate it. it was too late. We gotta make them cough it up. So that's basically what you get um, from attacking some of the greed demons. You don't get them from all of them, unfortunately. And I just made the grave mistake of going after the embodiment of sin. Because this guy is the hardest one to defeat. He's very annoying. He's not part of anything that he needs to do. He just gets in the way and he won't leave you alone until you annihilate him. And I'm just going away over the place because I'm backing up. See, that's that's the problem when you don't lock on. You will get attacked by a hell of a lot of more things. I don't need petty cash. There we go. So yeah, the uh, money that they're supposed to cough up, not all of them do it. Let's kill it. Go rob your own truck, dirtbag! I don't want to rob any. Though this is technically a bus. So they're kind of blinded by greed. So yeah, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to go around and uh, go after the corrupted citizens and the police guys. The police dudes. Because policemen be is just, you know, rob your own truck, so like yesterday. I hope I don't lose my badge for this. Right then. There we go. So, millions of greed spawn from the uh, money bags, and they're usually the ones that hand over the cash or cough up the cash. Let's teach this punk a lesson, partner. Thanks for stopping me before it was too late. Hope I don't lose my badge for this. You're, you're gonna lose your badge. I seem to do the same combination all the time for my uh, usual attacks. I should really mix it up. Let's do this one. There we go. Just because it does a hell of a lot of damage. So yeah. But I suppose it works for me doing it specific ways. That's why I do it. So I have another guy in the mix. Oh yeah, so number one is over here. I've seen mages infuriated when the Wrath Gen did not bend to their will. So, in each of the areas, there are two of these. That was just the uh, various variant one. This is number two. But I might have to, yeah, I'm going to have to destroy the guys around the area first. I'm a multi-millionaire. I don't Go need your own any truck, cash. Dirtbag. Thanks for stopping me before it was too late. Destruction! Chaos! For control. Number two. A red gem is rather fitting. The sin of lust has spilled much blood over the ages. But yeah, basically each of these just talk about the uh, seven deadly sins. Mine! Dear. Mine! Oh, dear. In this one you see Let's all of them. It. Including Pride, which is Raven. So there's no there's no Pride uh, minions. 
as Raven is trying to protect and serve, not loot and pillage. There we go. Um, get these guys to cough up some cash. Yeah, I'm gonna take your soul. Yeah, that one didn't drop it, so yeah. You don't get it all the time, unfortunately. Just drain you. Oh, I'm getting attacked by loads of people. Yeah. Annihilation for more of this. Okay. This is our So yeah, everybody wants a taste of fury. A taste of rage. You're a fool! Take the money! I would, but that isn't part of the mission. No, I'm not necessarily a greedy person. But certainly, uh, as I said, envy. Envy is about quite a lot of things. Not necessarily people as such, but more talent and skills and everything. Which is kind of weird, I think. But everybody's weird in their own way, I suppose. And then... Some pride, I suppose. I don't know. I suppose being self-conscious is to do with pride, to an extent. The extent. Go rob your own to protect and serve. Because I always want to be a little better than what I sometimes am like. Go away! This is our fat loot. Go rob your own truck, dirtbag! I've never won a penny before. So go into journal. Finish off greed. I'm triangulating the source of all these demons. Trigon's daughter Raven is pride, so you won't be seeing that sin. Unless Trigon possesses her again. For like the hundredth time. So next one is gluttony. With each devoured soul, these gluttony demons feed Trigon the power he needs to pass through. Eliminate these demons and revert any corrupted citizens back to themselves. The corrupted citizens around this, this area are much, much easier to defeat. All it is is one hit, one kill. So, this area is the easiest to find the uh, investigations. Those glutton crazy citizens are attacking every hot dog cart they see. We gotta keep them from eating themselves to death. Blow up those carts! Will do. So, literally, number one is here. And number two is over there. If you just managed to get a quick glimpse of it. See over there. So I'm only going to show you one of them on the map. I'll only show you the one around here because you'll see the second one quite easily. Well, technically number four. But the second one in this area. So the gluttony demons actually spawn in quite fast. But you've got to defeat 20 of them anyway, so you may as well do it. Wait. All that glitters is not gold. <laughs> she learned that hard way. So, number four. I'm not afraid of you. Temptation cannot be destroyed, oh, no. but it can be managed. I'll eat you for breakfast. Beat you. But yeah, one hit to get rid of the citizens. It doesn't matter how much power you put into it. It can be the shortest, smallest amount of power and it still would be uh, enough. But I suppose because they are gluttonous and everything, they would be too tired to even bother with it. They don't even want to fight, they just want to just care about more about eating. Just kind of prove a point though. I don't want to go after them. There we go. I mean, it's clever um, how they put specific messages in there. Uh, such as. Well, especially with the sins, um, how they can really affect you as a person. So, you can see how the citizens are very discolored. It just proves, it's just showing them about how. Foods like that can just ruin you. <laughs> And um, 
Obviously, Breed can corrupt your mind, so you be blind to what you really are like. One, two, three, four, Back off. five. Good job I did that, seeing as the embodiment of sin wants to come after me as well. There we go. So, two more gluttony demons and just to reverse all the civilians. Simple. Time to hit the gym. So, we've got two minions over here. Just go after these. One. Where are you, number two? There you are. You get the lovely uh, maces. If you think those were bad, just wait until Trigon rises. I've triangulated their source at Ellsworth Hospital. Updating your map. I'm heading there right away. To do Wrath. These Wrath demons are the warriors of Trigon's sinful crew. If we can calm the souls of their victims, we break one more source of Trigon's power. So it's right over here. You want to stay clear of the Avatar of Sin around here because that's a bounty mission. It does Greetings. get in the way sometimes. The Sentinels of Magic seek to discover the magic behind these evils so we can better combat it. Can you collect demon energy for us from these corrupted souls? Yeah, sure. So this is practically like the... Uh, other thing, the greed one, but instead of going after the uh, oh, wrath minions for it, you have to interact with the metas. Or at least the corrupted citizens in that colour. So, yeah, there's the Avatar of Sin. Don't go after him unless you've got. Uh, multiple people around the area. Now I'm going to do the investigation thing around here after I've defeated these citizens because I'm going to move away. For example, this. okay. Thanks. I showed up to help, and these civilians just started attacking me. It's okay. Unthinkable. I hate violence. What happened? Was I mugged? Okay then, there you go. Gathering the Sin Gems for preservation in itself is a challenge to Sloth. So the next one is a very very hard one to find. Um, it took me a little while to find it. Um, obviously the first times doing this. But it is literally right over the other side. Right here. Spellcasters are particularly prone to the sin of envy. So you want to stay away from these. This is, I assume, a, an additional mission. I dare say it would be the uh, Amazonian one. Or something. No, it would be Sons of Trigon. There you go. But yeah. Just keep that in mind where that is because you have a good chance of missing it. So I want to go and continue this and uh, go after the wrathful citizens get the demonic en energy from it. What is wrong with everyone? Glad you came along when you And obviously uh, go after uh, no them. hard feelings right? Number one, number two, number three. What's going on here? So the ones that um, have um, it's saying uh, citizen on there, they're the ones that are going to have millions of wrath coming out of them. So it's just annihilate them. You feel brave, punk? I do. I'm so brave. I don't think I'm going to regret it. Get this one in time. Oh, only just. So getting the minions of Wrath around here is quite um, hard, well, much harder than it is in the other two areas. 
Um, it can be a little more scarce in this area. But if you wait around and be patient, you'll be uh, on your way nonetheless. So eight more minions to go and then I will obviously cut to the last one I'm um, defeating to do the area, well to do the uh, main part of the mission. This is what I mean about him being in the way and unfortunately because I am a flight character I go super slow so I'm gonna have to uh oh it's alright, bin he's gone. But yeah, it's so annoying when that happens. You just spawn randomly and you just like I hate you. <laughs> it is actually cool though because I've actually managed to, uh, well before they sorted out where all the bounties were at the combat rating of 52. Oh. I'm calling in the Sentinels of Magic. If Brother Blood is raising Trigon, you'll want the best to help take him down. So yeah, um, I've actually managed to defeat the Avatar of Sin on my own before, but that was before um, everything, all the bounties were at like combat rating of 52. Because what it did was, when I was well, obviously attacking it, when I was running low on health, I'd go here, and then it still it wouldn't despawn. Usually they despawn after a certain amount of time, but luckily it didn't do that. You won't be able to do that nowadays, though. But yeah, that was that was uh, a proud thing. Oh, so that might be the reason why I'm part pride. Yeah, it could be that. There you go. Finish off rough go and do Trigon's blood. This is the source of the evil. Brother Blood is barricaded inside and his vile ritual will bring Trigon to this plane unless we can stop him. Zatanna, Dr. Fate and Raven will join you inside. Fight for all our souls. Soul fighter! Yuck! All these demons in here cannot be sanitary. They all feed Blood's rituals, so take them out and drain his power. Will do. So yeah, she's supposed to talk. Let's do it again. I hope you can get those samples before this place is overrun. Yeah, good enough. And that is the voice of Zatanna. Great entrance. Help me take out these lost things. So yeah, first you're encountered with the minions of lust. Come on, follow me. Once in that will never be. <laughs> yeah. Too late. I am born onto this plane. Hail Trigon. Let Hail me show Hydra. You some real magic. Love those interlopers to Behind us! I know. There we go. So you swarm by these, which is even more fun to kill. Lots of more, lots of lots more to kill. Because it's great when you get to annihilate everything. Okay then. Stand back while I take down this barrier. I'm gonna stand right in front of it. She sort of sounds like a uh, cowgirl when she does that. I ain't waiting. Well, I technically was waiting there, but there you go. So, embodiment of sins are in this area, so I'm gonna have to go with it anyway. So, gluttony and greed are in this area. Oh, and yeah, just gluttony and greed at the moment. Anyone up for dessert? <laughs> Unfortunately, the embodiment of sin is after me still. I'm probably going to have to make a top 10 worst enemies and that guy's going to be on there as well. How can you never eat hot dogs again? Okay, so... Let's just kill off this minion of greed. Oh, and there's a lovely glutton sin over there. I'm a multi-millionaire. There we go. So yeah, um, all you need to do is collect essence. 
from the uh, minion, well, from all the uh, minions of Sin. And I could have revived that doctor, but it was too late. Paladin! Feel the wrath of my stuff. So you are around here greeted by a minion of sloth. Don't worry about it, you don't have to defeat him all. Dear Raven. Dr. Fate is up ahead. He will need your aid. So, meted by pride. And there are two embodiments of sins around here. You could I could skip them both, but they do give off quite a bit of XP, I think. Ow. Okay, so should do that. Oh, they give me, yeah, they give me 15 XP. So you got the other guy. You deserve Okay, the yeah, best. right there. So yeah, you may find that the majority of the uh, enemies that go after you actually have the martial arts skill. I suppose it's a generic skill. No, you don't need any more. Okay. No, you don't. You're only corrupted. I've never stolen a penny before. So these doctors, after you go after them, you can actually revive them. Which you're gonna do. Like that. Eh, uh, my bad. I hope the heroes kick your ass. So there's a chest over here, but I'm gonna have to defeat the embodiment of sin as well. I don't want a bear, thank you. These have an intention of knocking you back quite a bit as well. And setting you on, well, not necessarily on fire, but these flaming powers. Another embodiment of sin. Once the wrath of my mace. I can revive it in time. I'm just gonna get, you son of a bitch! Thank you. Oh, thank God that didn't actually get rid of me. Yeah, I decided to use a uh, mangle on my own accord. I didn't uh, accidentally press it or anything. Just revive the other two doctors here. Get a couple of XP from it. You and Raph. You probably realise that Envy hasn't turned up. That's because he's in the uh, last um, area where you have to go for a showdown and I'm always disorientated in this area. Right, go through here. So before you go after them you want to get the very last one which is here. Once the gems are all in hand it is difficult to resist the temptation to boast. Your victory is not faded, blood. Blasphemers! They dare to interrupt our summoning? Destroy them! Kill the blasphemer! Shun the non-believer! So yeah, before the uh, minions decide to make a turn of all the sins, you have to defeat all of Brother Blood's minions or followers or whatever you want to call them. So this area is actually quite a long area. You may find. Well this this is probably one of the uh, longest boss battles that you may have to face in normal uh, You trifle missions. with the power of Trigon! Demons arise and destroy them! So, here's the minion of Envy. Annihilated straight away. Sloth. Lust. Greed. Wrath. Gluttony. And you can't go after pride. Probably Blood's doing that anyway. So yeah, you need to, uh, 
Get him away from me! Hurry, get Not Brother Blood away yeah. from Raven. I'm doing it, I'm trying it. But there you go. So yeah, Brother Blood will uh, go after each of three rise, of these and then you... Demons, rise! Order so now you've got Exarchs. Yeah, they're fun. These take much longer to defeat, so I'm just going to use my uh, mangle. Just to uh, make it a little faster. Because I am aware that this is now shutting down in 20 minutes, but I'll be able to do it way before then. Gotta love it when they shut down the servers. Blood from torturing Dr. Fate. When the world burns, only the devoted will remain, while you will be nothing but ash. So, once again, you defeat, uh, you have to defeat six deadly sins. So, it sort of like repeats itself until yeah, you can defeat Brother Blood himself. There we go. So now he'll go after Satana. Brother Blood has triggered Satana. Drive him back. Boom! Yay! Leveled up. Burn! Burn in demonic fire! I Oh, I forgot. I've got these. Personal security. So yeah, you have to. Uh, Defeat the Exarchs again, or however you pronounce it. I call him that. Sounds weird though. And we'll mangle again. Just defeat the uh, continuous one, and then the raffle one will fall. Like so. No matter how you fight, Raven. Your fate is to be my bride and sit on the throne of blood. I'll die before I become your wife, blood. That, Bye. my dear, can be arranged! So yeah, now he'll be going after me. And this is where you can finally defeat River Blood. So you can use all of your abilities on him. And lock onto him. So let's just use number six and mangle him up. So Mangle can actually be interrupted, so you've got to be careful of what your opponent does. I just realised my health. So yeah, I need to uh, make sure I'm using that. There we go. Thank you, Zatanna. And Raven for the SP as well, though I'm using another. All done. Right. Now. Trigon will rise, and then you will burn! Yeah, so hot and warm. Wow, okay. Um, by the looks of it, they've sorted out some of the uh, enemies where you have the infinite lock on them. Brother Blood is dangerously close to raising Trigon. We have stopped him now, but be ready. Evil will invade this plane. Trust me, I'm always ready. Greed, envy, lust, wrath. My sin is pride. It was a gift from my father, the demon Trigon. I have fought this evil all my life found a new family, the Titans, and war. They stand with me against Trigon and his cult of blood, for Brother Blood will never rest with Trigon's energy on this planet. Trigon will rise, and just as surely, we will be there to meet him. Hence the DLC Sons of Trigon. So let's uh, finish off that bit and go on to fratricide. You have triumphed.
Trigon will not rise this day. Brother Blood must replenish his powers before he can strike again. Return to Cyborg and tell him that for now, we triumph. Although technically if you're on the villain side you do kind of raise Trigon. So yeah, it just depends on what storyline you go with. See, I've always preferred my villainous stuff. I've always, uh, if there's an opportunity to do evil or uh, good, I would always go for evil. I don't know why, but no, most of the time it seems kind of cool. And we are returning to Cyborg. You put a serious dent in Brother Blood's plans. Consider yourself invited to kick Trigon's butt with the Titans anytime. I would gladly accept that. So let's see what's going to be not on the next one because I intend to do a uh, an alert, but the one after. Poison Ivy's reported loose in Gotham. Check in with Robin in the East End Police Station. He's got a plan to take her back to Arkham. So yeah, I'm heading over to uh, Nightwing, and I'm doing the Poison Ivy one, which. I also like. So that's it for this one. Uh, like I said, let me know which is your deadly sin and I will see you in the future.